So, where the saga is at now is that Chelsea has gone off the deep end. I will quickly catch you up. There is a popular TikToker influencer by the name of Modern Warrior, a.k.a. Lance Tosi, um, who is a Native American activist, TikToker, influencer, who involved himself with two women, Amanda and Chelsea. There is a third woman who has asked not to drag this on. She gave her two cents in their regards to their relationship. They broke it off. She carried herself well. She's not being obsessive. She's not crying over him. But Chelsea and Amanda have taken this to a whole other level. Um, Chelsea went on to say that she had a sexual relationship with Lance for six months. That was indeed romantic. She wanted it to be exclusive. He asked her if she was into polyamory. She said, no, I just wanted to be us. He then dumped her after having intercourse with her. Uh, he did not disclose to either of these women that he was into polyamory, which, you know, he wanted to have more than one partner. He did not disclose that to them. He was un having unprotected sex with these women. Yes, he's fixed, but that does not mean that, you know, he could not potentially pass something on to these women that he's sleeping with. He is married, apparently. He is married. There is a, his marriage certificate that has been made public. I'm not sure if his, his missus agreed to this lifestyle. It was unbeknownst to her, but she chewed him out for it. and let him know that she was not comfortable with that. I don't know. Um, right now, Chelsea has gone off the deep end. Um, she's saying, I didn't want to share you with 3.3 million people. You know, I just wanted to be just you and me. And she's like, I have so much love for him. You know, I can show him. He's you know, He knows that. People didn't know who he was six months ago, and I know who he is, and da 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 da. And it's just like, girl, give it up, please. Yeah, he got rejected. He slept with you. He rejected you because you didn't want polyamory. Let it go. But she's obsessed. Like, you know, it's crazy. I don't care who she's with. I don't care who she's into. I don't care what her preference is. But to falsely. Entrap an indigenous man with the thought that she was pregnant with a child that could have been his to trap him with that would be uncalled for. Now he's not said anything. He apologized to Chelsea. He did not include the other two women he was seeing. Um, I don't have any bitterness towards him uh, practicing polyamory, but I think he should have been honest with these people, with these women. Uh, he needs to be more careful because this Kelsey woman has gone nuts. She's been crying tears. You know, what pissed off the Native American community, the indigenous group, was the fact that she cried her fake ass white tears to get sympathy because she said that she had miscarried a baby when it wasn't a miscarriage. It was an abortion. Um, both her and Amanda got the attention they wanted. Meanwhile, we have many missing, murdered indigenous women, men, and children. Children's, more children's graves have been found in residential schools. They have yet to be brought home, yet we're all obsessed with this love triangle that includes Lance, Chelsea, and Amanda. Amanda has gone quiet because she doesn't want the backlash, but she inserted herself in this because she came forward. She too had unprotected sex with Lance, and now she's she's trying to backpedal, but she's adding fuel to the fire, saying, "I know where I know some stuff about him. I know about his family, and I know where he lives." Da, 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 da. That could set him up to get hurt. There's white supremacist groups that know who he is, know his address, and could use that to their advantage to hurt him, which means we possibly wouldn't have him anymore. Um, I do not wish ill will on him, any physical harm. I do wish, though, that he would be more honest with women. I don't care what their race, shape, color, size is. He should be honest with them because he has a white woman going crazy simply for the fact that she wanted to have a relationship with him. She wanted babies with him, and she's only, she only dated him for six months. 
And she's like, I wanted to have children with you. I wanted to build a life with you. You know, it, it just being you and me. And he said, no, I want more than one partner. And if you're not done with that, I'm leaving you. I'm, I'm ditching and I'm going to go find me another chick that's going to be done with that. Um, he needs to do better. He, you know, the native, the indigenous community is trying to hold, you know, hold him accountable and hold the other um, creator that's caught in the center of the same, the, the other incident which um, involved the makeup artist, um, which included assault. She, her story was eclipsed with this love triangle. Um, an indigenous little girl had gone missing and has been found deceased. Her story was overshadowed by this incident. And now it's flooded my For You page. Did I believe these women at first? Yes. I wanted them to expose him and for him to come clean and say, yes, I did do this. This is what my lifestyle is and this is what I'm into. Um, I'm sorry if I've hurt anyone, etc., etc. But for right now, he's chosen to keep quiet. I've unfollowed him and I've unfollowed the other indigenous creator that is in the center of the scandal involving the makeup artist. Um, I wish no ill will on Lance. I do wish that he would choose better partners um, and be more vocal with the ones he chooses to involve himself with. Um, I just want this to end, but it won't because it's been on my For You page for the past three, four, five days. However many days it's been and it's ballistically gone crazy and we're not going to hear the end of it. This is just the tip of the iceberg. Um, I, I, I feel fooled. I feel like I've been lied to. I mean, I, 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 I love Lance because he, he carries himself so beautifully and is so well educated and knows how to present himself, uh, as he chooses, but this whole thing makes me despise him as a human being. Because as a man, you're supposed to be honest. If you're into polyamory, you should say, yo, this is what I'm into. If you're not done with that, then we'll just finish this date and I won't bother you ever again. But he wasn't honest with those women because he made them believe that there was nobody else but them. And he didn't even tell his spouse either. I don't know how she feels about that. But this has gone to a whole different level now. And we're never going to hear, hear the end of it. So, alright. Thanks. Bye.